Let's take a look at Pete's Red Zone Sports. Now, Pete is not here today, obviously. Um, but nonetheless, Mark and I are going to handle the Red Zone Sports. <laughs> and uh, we're going to kick it off with Olympic basketball. The dream team. The dream team that we've got this year is indeed um, loaded with talent. But there are a couple teams out there that are also pretty loaded with NBA talent and NBA uh, comparatively, uh, many of those teams that play in Europe and the players that elect to play over there, perhaps rather than the NBA, are right on that same kind of level. I'm talking about France. I'm talking about Serbia, um, Germany. I mean, there are a lot of good teams out there. And in fact, those three teams are all in the finals. France, sir, uh, semifinals, I'm sorry. France, Serbia, Germany, and of course, our dream team. Now, the question is, Mark, um, we've got Germany in the semifinal, and Germany is going to have to uh, uh, match up with some pretty good NBA players uh, that usually are playing, again, uh, for Serbia. Right. Uh, and that makes it a very interesting matchup because these guys know each other. Um, they have played together perhaps in some of the pan-European championships yeah. before getting over into the United States. So... This Olympic semifinals, the United States is going to be playing France, but Germany is going to be playing Serbia, and that is going to be a big game. Yeah, I, I think that's definitely going to be one of the must-see TVs uh, when it comes to this particular component of, of the Olympics. Been very impressed with Team USA. Team USA overall performing very strongly across many categories during these Summer Olympic Games in Paris, no doubt. And we'll wind it up, folks, with... Uh, the most decorated, most medals ever in an Olympics. This guy has won five gold medals in the same sport. He is an Olympic grappler. He is a heavyweight wrestler. It's Mijan Lopez from Cuba. He's a super heavyweight wrestler. And can you even imagine, Mark, anybody winning in five Olympics? Winning! not just competing in five Olympics. And we do have several people like Mr. Phelps, of course, who did back-to-back -back huge performances and did the Mark Spitz with all those medals hanging around his neck and so forth. Well, this guy, uh, gold five separate times, just cemented himself in Olympic history. Unreal.